Okay, happy to see you here. Welcome back to my channel, Higher Mathematics. Really interesting challenge today, quick and relaxing challenge. But in the same way, it looks like a weird challenge because we have a 2 to the x equal to 3 to the x. What can you say about our x? How is it possible? Right here 2, right here 3, how can we find our x right here? And it's really great and tricky uh, challenge and I want to solve this right now. Before solving this, I want to say thank you for your support and please leave a like, write, any comment. Uh, it really inspires me a lot and it keeps my channel alive. Yeah, your support, your likes keep my channel alive and I make new videos. I try to make it every day. So thank you and let's try to solve it. First of all, we need to know about log. Without log, it's absolutely impossible to solve this question because we have our x as a power. So how can we work with this? We have right here as a power so it's it's really hard but if you know a little bit about log for example this property if we have log right here m and went right here for example p this p goes right here so as a result we have p times log m and right here n so this is the main property that we really need so let's apply log on both sides so we have log we have 2 to the x and equal to log 3 to the x. But as you know, we need to work with the base. So let's write, for example, base of 2. Doesn't matter what base do you choose. Uh, we will have, of course, the same answer because we apply on both sides. So let's go with, for example, 2. And let's go right here, for example, 2. Doesn't matter. Log 2, base of 2. Doesn't matter. So as I told before, this x jump right here and this x jump right here. This is our first step. We really need to know about this step. So we have x log 2 base of 2 equal to x right here log 3 base of 2 okay okay so what we're we going to do next you should know a really great rule maybe a really great trick that uh, every time you have uh, like a uh, looks like equation look like another type of uh, expression you should group your axis on the left hand side and your constant on the right hand side all the time but right here we have really tricky moment because x with the constant we have on the left hand side and x with the constant we have on the right hand side so we should group it on the left for example let's group it on the left yeah so we have x times log 2 base of 2 minus x log 3 base of 2 equal to 0. Okay, equal to 0. So we group it. And we know a really tricky moment because we can easily factor this x. We have x right here, we have x right here, so we can easily factor our x. So we have like x and in parentheses we have log 2 base of 2 equal to 1. We, we all know about this case. This is a classic case in log. So 1 minus and this one log 3 base of 2 log 3 base of 2 equal to 0 equal to 0 okay this expression and what is our x what is equal to our x right here we have a product of two like values so this one and this one but if you look closely to, uh, to this parentheses we have right here a constant so constant which is obviously not equal to 0 this constant is not equal to 0 so all the all the hopes on this x so uh, only uh, hope uh, that this solution have root when x equal to zero we, when e, this is not equal to zero then x 100 percent should be equal to zero so x equal to zero this is our answer so maybe someone fill this uh, fill this root all uh, maybe two to the zero equal to three to the zero this is maybe uh, the obvious root for for most of you but i wanted to record this solution i wanted to show how can we solve this with log maybe you you know another option you know another answer it will be really interesting to read about it write your suggestion down into the comment section so let's write our answer let's write our answer x equal to zero because right here two to the zero equal to three to the zero is absolutely correct so this is my solution to this question i hope you learned something new i hope you understand my explanation and i wish you all the best in your adventures thank you for your time and have a great day